All right, we're here with Aaron, who top, what, top eight? Yeah, I got Oh, uh, yeah, the regional in Richmond. And what'd you play, man? Uh, Fluanderies. Fluanderies. Uh, All right, well, let's show us how you played it, or your list, at least. Okay. I lost to round one. Uh, I drew a playable two games in a row, and then I just won seven straight. So, All right. Um, and the deck is pretty brain dead, um, and I just couldn't think of anything else to play. So, uh, hand traps with three ash, three shifter, it's like pretty normal. Uh, three Rubina, three Eagle in, uh, one street, one Tukin. It's a pretty normal lineup. Um, for the other like normal summons, uh, one barrier statue, one harpist. This card wasn't really played very much before, but it's starting to pick up. It didn't come up, it didn't come up a lot for me compared to my friend who topped uh, the same regional from three weeks ago with a similar list. Uh, but I think this card won me one game. It's just pretty well positioned. It's like it's it's Karen, and it's also just like Skarm in the end phase for any any like wing beast in your deck. So I just thought it was worth playing. And um, I played DD Crow, but uh, this card was for DP prior. I just like forgot to take it on my deck before I submitted it. Uh, but like it, it, it came up. I, every time I searched this off for Mina, like it was like in a relevant position. Like I hit a couple of Shunas and like a Water Enchantress. With this. Then um, the Tribute Summons. Uh, this is like pretty normal. Like I don't think this is worth cutting because like you can just advent all these cards away if you brick on them so i think they're worth like i don't think it's worth to play any less than the, any less than four tributes mm -hmm. uh some people are playing two ryza over mist valley i think it's just like the same thing like you always lose this back to your hand with the sound effect so like one is effectively two so it's just it's however you prefer to play the deck i guess uh three uh field spell i didn't play terraforming because i'd be too tempted to play i think it's a in the main deck uh three advent uh, three pots, uh, three prosperities. Uh, you kind of have to play this card. Uh, like, let's just see, like, seeing six cards, it helps the consistency of this deck so much. And then I have main three Dark Ruler. I think this should have been Infirm because no one's playing combo decks right now. Uh, everyone's playing very low ceiling decks because they don't know what to play because of the ban list. Uh, there were a couple times I do this going first where I wish it was infirm, like I could just like set it. Uh, but you know, like realistically, like this was a card to kind of help you compete with all the combo decks. But now that Verte is out of the format, this may not be necessary. Uh, then two books, this is a good game one card. Uh, wins. Uh, I didn't know until round five of the regional. Uh, that this, the tribute, your opponent's card, uh, was not once per turn, so, yeah, that's a really good card. Uh, called, this, I didn't draw this at all, this is my 41st card, it probably just cut this, I don't think it's been very relevant. Uh, and then the trap, the trap's crazy. Traps, Book of Eclipse, and Escalation of Monarchs. Uh, extra deck, uh, played three of the rank one, like, bird cards, a downer, and a Zeus. Uh, this was wrong. I should have played. I don't need to play two downer, but I do think you play any two Zeus. I lost a game against a zombie deck, that main deck, Zombie World, and Banshees because I didn't play a second Zeus, so that kind of sucks. Uh, Gustav and Leap. Um, if you have two pins on board and your opponent has a lot of monsters, hypothetically, you could just kill them with this, but. Oh, and this is good in time too. You just burn your opponent. Uh, Two thousand. Uh, I never. This never came up, but like I, I don't think I'd take it out. It seems. I think it would come up in a longer tournament. Uh, one phoenix, unicorn, zombie world outs, uh, Farjet, uh, Intis, and Trig for the Maximus, or, uh, the Dogmatica targets, I guess. Uh, this card comes up less because DP is not summoned as much as it used to. This card comes up more because Baron is more common than it used to be. Like, uh, if you get like if you get stopped playing against Sword Soul, you like link a you summon Anima to take their Baron and then swing over their Xiao, and then you link into this and summon back their Baron. It's pretty good, and this is like the best like link one you could play. It's the extra deck. You never like realistically you don't touch this like most games. Uh, side deck, three cosmic. Uh, oh, I just dropped a card. Two lightning storm. Uh, duster. Uh, three evenly matched. Oh, there we go. Uh, these are all like my like, board breaker back row hate uh, cards. Like you kind of have to play just a lot just to compete with most like the meta decks right now. Um, this deck doesn't really get anywhere from playing like single point of interaction hand traps or just trading with your opponent. You just kind of need cards that deal with all your opponent's cards. 
Um, I also played uh, two Regeki, uh, but it was just because I couldn't find a third Lightning Storm. If I had a third Lightning Storm, I'd probably cut these two entirely and play uh, Red Meteor. Okay. On top D Fisher, it's a good going first card so you don't get drolled. And it's also a Floodgate and then Harpies. Um, I found myself siding in this uh, when I would go side this going first because this is good against all the low uh, low ceiling and mid range decks, but it, people like routinely side back row removal against Flunder. So, like, if they Twin Twisters or like Duster this, like, you can just search like a Harpies for free. So, okay. Yeah. And you didn't play uh, the most powerful hand trap in your deck, did you? Powerful hand. What was that? The uh, banished guy. What's his yeah, name? Yeah, he's in, he was in here. Oh, I didn't. I didn't see him when you oh, went yeah, through. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, Shifter. I, I I played three. Uh, I drew it. I think two times, and I resolved it once. Uh, it's it's like okay. Um, I feel like a lot of the decks right now, like uh, I think like all the cyber decks, I like, kind of like get crippled by this. But you know, like Despia realistically can still kind of like play under Shifter. Uh, they just don't have as much recursion. But, um, I don't know. Like this. This was kind of like just to guarantee you didn't get an Emperor Band Sheet after siding, so I don't know, it's okay. Alright, well thank you so much, and congratulations on your top. Yep.